Okay, Mike and Natalie, I want to go back to a fight that you two had at the last tell-all. That huge, huge fight. It was about Mike's friend, Sarah. That was the time I said, I know this relationship is over. I said, I was shocked because that was one of the most intense moments, I think, that I have spent at a tell-all. Let's watch. If you say you love, you don't make pain, you don't betray it. Mike, what is she talking about? So I have a best friend. She wanted me to be like her best man. It was the night before the wedding. I went back to the house, slept on the couch. Nally was pretty much assuming like we slept together. Why well, you said her husband is going to be there? Because her husband, her husband was supposed to be there. there. I didn't lie. I, I didn't. I, that was the plan. Michael, I don't get stoned at some guy's house and wake up half naked at his house and call you. I never do it. I wasn't naked. I don't cheat, I don't lie. You cheat and you lie and what? you get caught. This is the problem and I cannot okay. stand it. <sighs> well, uh, Sarah never got a chance to tell her side of the story, but we have her here today to set the record straight about what really happened the night that Mike slept over her house. Welcome, Sarah. Hello. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. Sarah, did you think that Natalie and Mike were a good combination? No. Why not? There's a lot of factors that play into it. You know, he's a jokester and he likes to play around and Natalie's kind of a serious person. Um, and then there's a huge cultural differences and it can be extremely stressful, so. Yes. Sarah, when Natalie thought something happened between you and Mike the night that he slept over on your couch, uh, what actually happened? Well, he flew in on Thursday. I got married on Saturday. He got in really late Thursday night. He came over to the house. I had um, multiple people staying at the house. And we hung out and we went to bed. Um, my husband was supposed to be there, but unfortunately, you know, plans changed. Mm. So he ended up staying at his place. So you knew Mike was going to spend the night at the house, but you thought that her fiance was going to be there also. Uh, when you found out he wasn't there, you actually thought that they were intimate. I let's say I had the fear and I produced it on the situation. I had the fear 